Yeah, welcome back friends. Uh Dr. Mlewa hapa. Na leo nataka tuone solution kidogo ya paper ya eh, Advanced Biology 2021. Na najua wengi mme mmepata kuna mtali share katika group ya Telegram. Kwa hiyo pia nichukue chance kukualika kwenye group ya Telegram. Link itakuwa kwenye description. Eh tembelea tu group ya Telegram. Kuna material mbalimbali ambayo tunakuwa na share ya masomo notes na vitu kama hivyo. Kwa leo nitaenda swali one question after another. Hata kama sitamaliza lakini nitataka ni explain every question in detail. Ulitakiwa ueleze nini? Nitegemea nifanye hata miaka mingine lakini muda hakuniruhusu sana kwa hiyo ngoja tu nifanye ya mwaka huu alafu tukapo baada hapo tunachoona wakati mwingine tunafanyaje. So here we have hili ni paper la Nekta e, mwaka mwaka huu tuna paper ambayo inaonekana hapo and i hope wewe mwenye unaweza kawa tu umeiona kwenye muonekano hapo mzuri kabisa ni United Republic of Tanzania the National Examination Council of Tanzania Advanced Certificate of Secondary Education Biology 1 2021 the exam is 3 hours and then after that um after that this paper consists of section a b c with a total of 10 questions answer all questions in section a and two questions from section b are uh, from section b so um, from there section a carries 70 marks and section b carries 30 marks uh, number four except for the diagrams which must be drawn in pencil or writing should be in blue or black ink our five solar phones and authorized material are not allowed write your number katika kila booklet wewe unasema sasa anasoma anasoma via nini sasa okay actually i know kwamba inaweza ikawa sio muhimu sana kwako lakini wacha tu nilisome vitu vingine nilisome ili kwamba viweze tukukupa picha kwamba sometimes hata hizi instruction tu ndizo ambazo huwa zinawatengenezea tu test ya ngombo cha naona basi nimesha fail mtihani sasa twende tu kaanze kuchambua pepa yetu uh, katika hizi instruction nyingine i think instruction zote zimeishia hapa so we can start going into our paper na tukaona nini kimo ndani ya pepa Um, so yeah here you have so katika swali la kwanza i sema brief describe the stages of ostrich cycle brief describe the stages of ostrich cycle so Actually mimi sikutaka kutumia uh, akili au kutumia energy kubwa kati ya kusolve hili pepa. Kwa hiyo kwa sababu hiyo nilitaka tu every kind of answers niwe na inakusomea au kama una notes zangu basi tuko umezipata moja kwa moja kwa notes. Lakini uh, I don't see my reproduction exercise book here now kwa sababu I'm always teaching using my books ambazo nilikuwa nazitumia hata nikiwa nasoma advanced biology kwa hiyo kwa sasa hivi sijaliona lilipo lakini i hope next time nita liona na nikiliona lilipo basi nita hiyo sio swali gumu swala tu ni kwamba nisahau ambapo niliweka daftari uh, b justify the need for ostra cycle in female animal why is it important the stages pamoja na advantages of ostra cycle i am sorry hilo swali sitalijibu na unaweza kuona kwamba mbona sasa ni kama kujiandaa Actually mimi ku solve paper sio lazima niwe nime nimesoma au niwe nimepitia kama ambavyo mmezoea for most people au hasa kwa wengi ambao ni walimu lazima aje kufanya correction lazima pitie kwanza mimi sio lazima nipitie kwanza kikubwa na kuna vitu navijua na kwa sababu sijasoma muda mrefu so sija havipo ni head lakini i can just give you concept Ninachotaka kuchambua ni kwamba swali moja baada ya jingine nakuwa nalichambua. Unaona kwa mfano hapa anasema every each question carries 10 marks. Asa kwa mfano hata kama sijaelezea stages za ostrich cycle, uh, sijaelezea stages pamoja na kujustify the need of ostrich cycle. 
lakini tayari unajua hili swali na marks ngapi Kumi. ukishajua marks moja kati ya kitu ambacho na code na consider hata kujibu maswali ya biology ni marks ili swali na marks ngapi unaona brief describe the stages of post cycle unajua ni biology marks tano usifikiri tu ni mchezo kwa sababu hata marks moja kuipata ni very hard kwa hiyo ukikuta swali imeandikwa 5 marks manake you need to explain actually um, nikipata notes nitatafuta njia ya kushare aidha kwenye my telegram group au anyway otherwise so after that swali namba mbili wanasema find the respiratory quotient rq for the complete respiration of glucose i hope that is one among the very easiest question on hata kwenye notes za respiration unajua utakuwa unafahamu kwamba hilo hilo swali lipo katika notes za respiration sijua kwa 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 lakini yeah, kwenye hilo swali it's one among the very easiest question remember uh, the complete oxidation of glucose in aquaje find the respiratory quotient for a complete respiration of glucose and remember that is 10 marks question a b give 7 points justify the need for fermentation process to animals uh complete oxidation of glucose in a perikea formation ya carbon dioxide and the water reaction of glucose with oxygen complete oxidation formation of carbon dioxide and the, and the water so ukishajua carbon dioxide plus oxygen tunapata uh, i mean glucose plus oxygen tunapata carbon dioxide and water una balance the chemical equation ukisha balance unaangalia the ratio of carbon dioxide molecules produced the ratio of oxygen consumed ukisha pata hiyo ratio manake ndio itakuwa ji black Uh, ni kwa naangalia hapa ni kwa naangalia hapa mambo ya respiratory quotient katika gases exchange notes zangu za gases exchange bado haziko live haziko online lakini i have them still i have them in my book respiratory quotient actually sitaenda faster katika hii solution lakini nitataka tu elewane tu respiratory quotient ala q tumeshata koko ala q bazo metabolic rate then respiratory quotient complete oxidation of glucose is one so um, i hope you can see this actually i know it's it will try to adjust my camera here so that um, you can see some of the tail which i show you um unaweza kwa unaona but uh, hope yeah you can see this reaction i hope it's not much clear as expected yeah but actually ni kwamba hapa tunakuwa tunangaa na glucose moja oxygen sita carbon dioxide sita na water sita so uh, tunakuwa tuna glucose moja oxygen sita carbon dioxide sita na water sita kwa ratio of carbon dioxide produced the ratio of oxygen consumed carbon dioxide produced ni sita na oxygen consumed ni sita so it is six divided by six so the answer is equal to one So um, you can you can write the equation and then you can write uh, the additional information. Why we write the additional information is because swali ni marks nyingi. Maana yake hapa atakusema hizo 7 points advantages of uh, fermentation or the need of fermentation 7 uh, points then tuka tukasema kila point iko na marks moja maana yake swali yenyewe itakuwa marks tatu. So marks tatu it's not easy to kusema kwamba labda unaandika tu jibu mmaliza no lazima uanze kuandika reaction consider unaanza kusema consider the uh, respiration complete oxidation of glucose and then after writing that consider the complete oxidation of glucose unasemaje unaandika the reaction then unasema from this uh, from this equation uh, it is cut clear unasema it's clear that it is clear that in a given time the volume of carbon dioxide produced during respiration of carbohydrate Uh, volume of carbon dioxide produced during uh, the respiration of one molecule of carbohydrate or one molecule of glucose is the same with the volume of oxygen consumed 
or the number of moles, you can say the number of moles of the carbon dioxide gas produced is equal to the number of moles of oxygen consumed during the reaction. So the respiratory caution for the complete oxidation of, carb of carbohydrate of glucose for our test for some combat is will be equal to Tangaria Pokomba is equal to Yere times Yere Pare to Pato Gibla Combarum one six times six Kotoka Yibana to present Kalibu. I give seven points to justify the need for fermentation process to Tani. Uh, actually, when I was in Kasema Combar, Nashindo Kuera San Irimia Tanzania, Najua sometimes to Novo Ongea Vitu, sometimes we can be caught and to Novo Kaurizo Masual and Body Magum na to Kashindo Kujib. Uh, na shindo kuelewa elimu ya Tanzania kwa sababu eh ukifuatia kitabu cha tai na uh, i have the tai book here but i know hapo ukifuatia kitabu cha tai hautakuta uh, point ambayo ameweka hizo seven uh, seven points to justify the need for fermentation i know haitakuwa ina hizo points let i look it quick lakini najua tu probably haitakuwa nacho kwa hiyo niangalia hapa katika computer yangu let i go here and then we can put up a temperature tie quick nione kama waliweka importance of fermentation na kama waliweka alivyoweka ngapi nione hapa faster i want to be fast um waliweka ngapi <coughs> sorry Oh, uh, yeah, Tai Hajafika had his uncle, so I got to me and the day. I didn't know you are over there. Tai Taqua in his appointment was out dying in a tear, cutting a topic mingi. In a tear, topic mingi in a tear. Aina point comes sasa. Nina sema serikali tunakomoa na kusababu Mnaandika kitabu cha tai ambacho wakina hizo point Na mnataka mwanafunzi Azitafute sasa azitafute wapi um, Katika nusu zangu Katika types of fermentation Tunalizwa justify need for fermentation process to animals Or fermentation process to animals um, Actually hilo swali bwana seven points Hello swali ni moja kati ya top question kwa sababu hizo point kuzipata ni kazi ngumu. I only have um, my economic economic importance of alcoholic fermentation. And the, in animals uh, the category of fermentation which is taking place is lactic acid fermentation resulting into the formation of the lactic acid. Lactic acid fermentation is always taking place in animals. So the importance of formation of lactic acid. Kwa mimi, kama ni kusana swali kama ili katika next examination mingi vibuizi economic importance za alcoholic fermentation. Ndizo pointi ambazo ni gekuwa nazo kwa sumabu. Atuwezi kajibu pointi ambazo watuna. Na anaweza ni kakwambia kwamba mimi kiukweli anaweza ni si fike level hizo lakini nadhani and uh, takiwa ni fight kuweza ku criticize kile ambacho nekta wanakifanya we, we must criticize it ni wani weyo wanada najua kwa wanafunzi ya muwezi lakini kwa mimi ya hata kama siyo mwalimu lakini I can criticize I can, I can, I can criticize yuneza ni kaenda balaza mitiani ya ni kauliza why this happened kwa sababu kama balaza mitiani wanatoa e, miti, wanatoa kitabu au e, the Tanzania Institute of Education tai wanatoa kitabu ambacho wakina point and finally, on a good good summer sword and what does it mean? Quanino or toy tabo by checking a point then actually at a Jana Nikona, Jerim Kuenda Tassis, Limopa de Salam, a squeeze of Pika Lakini. I hope one day I will reach Tassel and Tanzan Institute of Education, and the other day we reach even when your fist is an act and a police of a sword come and a corner who are concerned. And I hope one day nita nita wapo majibu au even when I'll be there I will record a video 
uh, with some of the officers and then they will they will explain it they will answer it um economic importance of alcoholic fermentation is another pa kwanza moja they are used in the brewing industry katika viwanda vya kutengeneza eh, pombe ambazo tunatengeneza bia na wines second carbon dioxide produced from fermentation is used in the baking industry katika kutengeneza mikate na third vegetation is produced by uh, vegetation is produced by fermentation of activity of lactic acid bacteria no no kwa hiyo hizo ni baadhi ya point chache lakini don't worry don't worry najua nekta ni kawaida tu wanafunzi complain bwana nekta imetoka ile yetu lakini mimi nawaambia i will be a new hope i will be a new hope and i will make sure kwamba najaribu kutatua hilo kwa kadri nitakavyoweza so move to question number 3 I'll give four points to support each of the following facts. Kwanza natural system of classification have has never been achieved in fullest sense. Give Azamaje give four points to support each of the following facts. Natural system of classification have never been achieved in the fullest sense. Actually hapa utakuwa unazungumzia kama disadvantage of natural classification lakini auta zungumza direct in terms of disadvantage kwa mfano let me project to you my classification notes here mm, classification actually si you ask mbuki niweka wapi ndio maana unaweza kuona sometimes i just like scratch yeah here are the my notes you see mm, classification hapa it is 64% yeah so um na tutaka kueleza ni kwamba tunaelezea disadvantages za classification lakini hatutazielezea uh, zote kama is expected kwamba tutaelezea zote no hataweza kuelezea zote kwa sababu mbalimbali um ile ad device subiri kidogo niweze ku fanya baadhi ya vitu hapa. Yeah. Here. Now. Here. Go from there. Ya yeah, nataka tuone a uh, adva- uh, hizo nini? Hizo disadvantage of natural classification lakini hatutazielezea full kivipi? Basi tutanielewa tu kwamba ninavyosema tutazielezea full na maana gani? Uh, tumesema natural system of classification katika swali letu katika swali letu liko nasema natural system of classification natural system of classification najaribu hapa kuweza ku ku remove baadhi ya vitu hapa program yangu iweze kufanya kazi vizuri um, katika swali letu liko nasemaje no 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 katika swali letu liko nasema uh, give four points to support each of the following fact natural system of classification have never been achieved in the fullest sense hatujawahi ku achieve the natural system of classification in the fullest sense kwa nini yani kwa nini tunasema hivyo kwa nini tunasema hivyo katika swali letu kwa nini now eh twende katika majibu sasa twende katika majibu ya hilo swali na katika majibu ya hilo swali tunasema hivi tunaeleza natural system ya classification na vile ambavyo natural system ya classification inaweza ikawa ina some few disadvantages to be achieved or some few challenges mm, katika systems of classification terminology katika system tuna artificial pamoja na natural system of classification so katika natural system of classification hii hapa inakuwa ina involve many characteristics and more especially we always deal with a divergent evolution hapa tuna deal na a homologous structure divergent evolution uh, similar structure uh, structures which are similar in composition but they perform different functions hasa katika demerits hapa unaona it is difficult to use since it contain a lot of information so tunachojibu ni kwamba natural system of classification cannot be 
achieved its fullest way quite because it needs a lot of reformation. It requires a lot of reformation so it cannot be achieved in its fullest way kwa sababu kuzipata hizo za information together them it's very difficult so tunatumia the merits or the disadvantage of natural system of classification kwa mfano ya pili it's relatively unstable hiyo uh, tuacha nayo kwanza ya tatu it is not possible to place organism tuacha nayo ya nne it is very expensive it is very expensive yeah hiyo inaweza kama moja kati ya reason to see achieve it fully being expensive na unaweza kukuta mtu hana hela ya kutosha kuweza kufanya gharama kama hizo hapo so this can be one among the reason it seems it is very expensive hiyo ina apply vizuri sana inafanya kazi vizuri sana kusema it is very expensive so the natural system of classification being expensive ni moja kati ya kitu ambacho kinaweza kufanya uh, ni moja kati ya kitu ambacho kinaweza kikafanya finally hii natural system of classification hiyo ni very difficult to be achieved kwa hiyo tumesema hapa kwamba kwanza ni difficult to use because it requires a lot of information so the way to collect the information inakuwa ni kitu ambacho ni ni difficult au kwa some of the information zinaweza zikawa missing some of the information they can be missing unaona kwa hiyo niweze kukwambia kwanza moja it cannot be achieved in its fullest way because it requires a lot of information and sometimes some of the information they can be missing especially here tunazungumzia eh, the information from the fossil fuels unaona fossil unaweza kupata baadhi ya fossil hazipo unapata fossil za mwaka 1900 unapata za mwaka 2000 za mwaka 1980 hapo uzipati so some of the information they can be missing more especially information regarding fossils lakini pia um, Uh, jambo la pili katika information hapo hapo katika informations hapo hapo jambo la pili it's it's very expensive katika ku collect au kugather hizo information utakuta ina require a safari mbalimbali uweze kusafiri kwenda different places to gather the information or to collect different plants and then finally kuweza ku so it is very expensive and due to high costs most of people they tend to simplify kitu ambacho kitakiwa kufanyika katika solar plant it is simplified simply because kwa sababu ya nini the cost inakuwa kubwa lakini pili it needs a skilled person and only few person they can consume time na kuweza ku yani skilled person ikumkuta professor and na classification wako unajua wenzetu wazungu kusoma ni intense acha na sisi kusoma ni ili tupate hela wao kusoma ni intense lakini number four it is more laborious and time consuming inachosha inachosha kwa hiyo mtu anasoma anasoma baada ya acha ni achane nayo lakini hata hizi disadvantage nyingine pia unaweza kutumia kwa mfano uh, yenyewe ni unstable yani natural system of classification organism unaweza kukuta leo kwa group hii kesho kwa group kwa sababu may involve new groups of organisms and it's not possible to place so actually this question requires the disadvantage of natural system of classification going back to my question paper i hope i have also another uh, question for classification um so i'll start to be scientists scientists prefer to use natural than artificial system of classification why hapo ni advantage kwa hiyo swali ni kama walikizunguka yani advantage na disadvantage of natural system of classification ni kama tu walikuzunguka namna fulani ili kwamba uweze kujua kwamba tuna tunafanya hizo swali kama so they prefer to use natural system of classification rather than artificial why then you are coming back and then you explain the advantages of natural system of classification as compared to the artificial system of classification our advantages are natural system of classification organisms are accurate placed in natural groups regardless of their observable features lakini remember this all my reason sense they prefer natural system of classification rather than artificial so always when you answer a question of this category uh, you need to compare the merits of natural system of classification 
and then you compare it with the demerits of their typical system of classification. So to compare advantage and the natural system to Najipata, then to compare with the disadvantages which we get in the artificial system of classification. Kwa hiyo manake, artificial system of classification, it has a few disadvantages. Ambazo, tunavokona sema merits of natural system of classification, tunajitaja pia with the disadvantages of the artificial system of classification in order to make a client, and in order to make a teacher, amena kwa na maki mtene wako wezi kwa razi. So organisms, they are accurate placed in net, any uh, natural groups regardless of their observable features. While in artificial classifications, organisms, uh, organisms, similar organisms, they can be placed in for different groups. However, it enables the identification of unknown organisms by looking one number. But artificial system of classification does not enable the identification of unknown organisms. It shows evolution relationship. Ah, we also got the difference compared to consider similarities. Try to put organisms in their natural groups. The difficult, ah no, <laughs> yeah, we also consider it difficult because of that is disadvantage. Don't use the disadvantage, please, or oh, please. It's to me disadvantage. To me only advantage. It's more accurate since it involves many characteristics. While artificial classification is less accurate because it involves only few or one characteristics. It prevents unrelated organisms being uh, grouped together. While artificial system of classification, sometimes unrelated organisms they are grouped together. It allows organisms which are genetically related to be grouped in the same time zone. Yeah, in artificial system of classification, we don't have this. It is universal use. We are here to nurture and I see you. See you when you get to the point. two, four points. Other hope. Apart from by our take no one of Zangu, we are on a part of point support. I hope point in a part of not to me quite out. I could not again a point in a part of three to a pop. Not a part of point on end on a forum. The enemy is in a long by one. I got my name now by a mina case of Skukush of Silali. Cross idea like a name now by a ham taki. I'm taking a taku. Only part of a soda like a miss in a long by. Mina long to be sana quiet. How about to not ski and act some of all? Uh, to move kwenda kwa swali nyingine na hilo litakuwa ni swali la ngapi litakuwa ni swali la nne kwenda kwenye another question swali la nne kwa ni swali na uzaje uh, question number 4 anasemaje yeah. question number 4 in eukaryotic cell, in a eukaryotic cell possesses many organelles with a specialized structure. Eukaryotic cell they possess many organelles with a specialized structure suitable for performing specific functions. How does each of the following structure enable the respective organelle to perform its role? Kwa hiyo manaki hapa, it is part of the organelle, ndiyo mbao tumepewa na tumaulizwa. How does it enable the organ to function? Kwanza ni tonoplast ni vacuum. How does the tonoplast help the the vacuum to function? Remember tonoplast ina act kama kama zirivu membri ni ingine. Tonoplast ina saidia kweza kukontrol materials inter and leave the vacuum. Remember unajua watu buwana ukiauliza swala kusu tonoplast anaanza kuelezea function kama vile anaelezea cell membri. No. Tonoplast ni tonoplast, cell membrane ni cell membrane. Let me try to open the notes of classification. I mean to open the notes of um, cytology for you in order to aid you understanding this part well. So um, my Adobe doesn't respond. Open file. Let me check. A little bit to see in my cytology notes here. It is yeah. Well, yeah. Me kufungulia kwanza na sio cytology apa. Wait, wait a little. Cytology. Bit kidogo tu. 
Subiri, subiri, subiri. Na kungua notes hapa. In the capture device. Na kungua notes hapa. Subo kwa hiyo nita nita zoom saito wa us china nini saito wa hiyo nita zoom us 64 kwa hivyo kwa hivyo wana kila isi and then nita zoom us 64 nita nita zoom us 64 nita kuja kwenye nini um Zoomu yu 64 wako Nataka niende kwenye Kwenye vacuum Nataka niende kwenye vacuum ya pa So vacuum Turn up class Vacuum 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 Oh Yeah Hizi not ziko kwenye application lakini kwa nye ambao mpendi Mnumua mnapenda kwa bule basi Someen tu wapa wapa someen ya papa Sio dandi Sio dandi Vakilis We have the vakili Ya katika functions of vakili Magnify you 100 Ya hili kwa ni micro body So functions of Hercules. Functions of Hercules. In aquatic organisms such as the Glena formation, it is temporary, temporary storage of waste such as tannins. Manake, it is not temporary storage of waste. This waste manake is in a coa. Is in a coa enclosed in a ire. Is in a coa enclosed in a ire nani. Na yule tono plastic yetu kwa yu. Ni laisi sana kwelezea Kwamba Ini plant They support a bunch of structures They can't have area of cell Virtually help with product Of certain secondary product After that Latex So actually unaweza kwelezea A loo of the membrane katika tonoplast Kama ambavu ilivo katika cell membrane Lakini remember the year we are talking of tonoplast Amba ino surround back so now the it controls uh it controls the amount of water and solids entering and leaving uh, from the vacuum no lambda uh in a in a in a in a in a, in a give the shape of the vacuum you know no? so vacuum in a member into a inner wall now bit come the corner is there that can sell every soul organelle una una is there po is there Unachimbua every cell organ ili final mbako na kuja Unamaliza Unamaliza organ ili zako Unamaliza organ So from there Swali ili nalofatia Walikuwa meuliza Glycocalyx ini Plasma membrane Actually meandika plasma membrane Asa unazo kwa uliza Nanekta nao na kwa sea gawa na kwa sea You see this Wanasema plasma membrane Plasma membrane ndo nini Atigia yiko existi kwa mbako so glycocalyx in plasma membrane. Uh, as I told you uh, regarding regarding our National Examination Council and how they are making the examination. So already the National Examination Council they are 
they are uh, composing uh, examination in such a way that ni kama vile kumkomoa mwanafunzi so actually hi make sense kwa sababu usitunge mtihani ili kumkomoa mwanafunzi so glycocalyx kwanza sio moja kati ya kitu ambacho ni common unaweza kukuta labda kwenye bees kwenye understanding hata kwenye camp bell bauri sio moja kati ya kitu ambacho ni common sasa tunafahamu wanaotunga mitihani wamefika vioni lakini usitutungie mambo ambayo wewe ulisoma kwenye ulisoma kwenye kwenye botani unaona wewe ulisoma botanic science ukasoma course botani unakuja kututungia kwenye botani unaona actually eh, i mean sio tu botani hata kwenye zoro, kwenye zoology au katika masomo yako ya chuo ulikuwa na chambua cell membrane ukakumbuka kitu si kitu ambacho unaweza kukuta kwenye vitabu common hata kwenye notes zangu hizi za cytology glycocalyx sio moja kati ya kitu ambacho nimekielezea katika nini katika plasma membrane lakini uh, the best thing ni kwamba pia i have two alternative i have many alternative so for this time i will use I will use the, the alternative of Google Chrome to help you answering this question. So tutakuwa tuna Google Chrome a uh, Google Chrome here and then I will I will find for this terminology glycocalyx the glycocalyx glycocalyx and then we are searching for the function. So glycocalyx Uh, literally means sugar coat i hope tunakwenda pamoja hapo kuhusu i hope tunaenda pamoja kuhusu glycocalyx here is my google chrome and i find it for glycocalyx so this wikipedia some of people they don't believe wikipedia sema ni reference ambayo ya minute okay anyway glycocalyx literally means sugar coat sugar coat is the network of polysaccharide that protect from the protect from cellular surface of bacteria which classifies it as the universal surface component of the bacterial cell found just outside the bacterial cell wall mm, unaona glycocalyx is also known in the pericellular matrix with the glycoprotein and glycolipid covering that sub- surrounds the cell membrane of some bacteria actually ukutana maswali kama hayo kwenye mtihani wa taifa unasema tu kwamba swali kama ile jamani sameane ila nitajibu maswali mengine. Tutajibu concept tunakaa kwa nayo lakini kwa maswali kama haya ambayo ni ya kupomoana always majibu yake huwa ni vigumu sana kwa nayo kwenye mtihani. So nataka ni search glycocalyx function here glycocalyx function at glycocalyx function So is highly charged layer of membrane bound biological molecule attached to a cell membrane this layer function at the barrier between a cell and its surrounding anyway hata hiyo function moja tu inaweza kutusaidia sana eh it acts at the barrier to search up another function nyingine enable certain bacteria to resist phagocytic engulfment by white blood cell in the body of protozoans and the soil water Glycocalyx also enables some bacteria to adhere to the environment surface. Kwa hiyo active barrier between the cell and the surrounding and uh, after that na enable to resist phagocytic engulfment yani bacteria kuliwa na white blood cell ina enable some bacteria to adhere uh, enable some bacteria to protozoans uh, enable some bacteria to adhere to environment surface. Yani kuadhere ni kama kujikamata bacteria yanajikamata kwenye rock kwenye at the function of glycocalyx actually nimesha kwambia hili swali is out of scope of, of our study kwa hiyo ni swali la kukomoana lakini nimekupa solution ili kwamba in case kwenye mitihani yenu ya ndani lakini uh, najiona kabisa nitatakiwa ni fight sana kwenda kutafuta hata national examination council na kuona tuna negotiate vitu kuhusu kwa sababu ni tatizo kubwa ambalo vinafundishwa vitu vya kawaida vinatolewa vitu ambavyo mimi ningependa tunafundisha kama tunafundisha wa competence basi tunatoa vitu ambavyo viko kwa competence hiyo hiyo so that's all about glycocalyx you can move to another part bio DNA in the nucleus DNA in the nucleus unafanya kazi ya kustore joint kinatiri 
it stores the link the empty material and it controls or uh, it controls the all activities of the cell the DNA in the nucleus also it controls the all activities of the cell then from there we have Christ in the mitochondria they include the surface area for the reactions of uh, electron transport chain to take place all of this I think new things in, in this question is glycocalyx in the plasma membrane you each one to kit kit yambacho at kuwana chitizo sinacho na hati gezoya kukiona always kwenye mitiani kwamba kiza kia kirefu hati gezoya kukiona mm, from there that is question number four and B describe the lock and the key model of enzyme action actually actually katika uh, katika mtiani wataifa saitoji na ba, ba ukeme sisi ko iyo ntopi kimoja sabu yu silabas ntopi kimoja so kuelezea block and the key model of enzyme action i hope all of you you know lakini siyajua kama hamjui kabisa lakini notes zangu za ba ukeme sisi bado siyafika huko so it's very difficult to show you the answers lakini ili moja kati ya kitu ya na i hope ili ni moja kati ya swala mbona common akira moja alijua kwamba tuna jibige swali kama hiyo hilo ni swali tu la ku explain na kwa sababu tayari tulikuwa na max kama kadhaa ukijui kama unajua function zaidi ya moja zile cell part stage moja andika zote unazijua kwa hiyo mtiani it's better kama ukaandika a lot of information rather than ukaandika less then number 5 straight uh, number 5 Nisuala nutrition Tuishi hapa jamani Nimefanya kipindi kila long Na bado na section B So I think today Sita waza kumaliza lakini tomorrow I will come and explain this section B Of our examination So thank you for being with me And there kumbia Watu wa subscribe channel yangu na Wendele kufuatilia vipindi vyangu Ntakapo kwa ninda kwa upload Siku hata siku So this is Dr. Mayo Lecturers. I hope you'll be one among people who will enjoy my sessions day to day. Na watakia wakati muema na usomaji muema.